All right, our last theorem is actually, it's the same thing, all right? It's the same thing. So I look and I see that, okay, these points intersect on the outside. So what it is is, you know, once again, take the, take the whole thing, all right? Here, I'll even erase this just so we can be clear. All right, take the whole thing, take J-O, and multiply it by the outside part. The big difference for this one is that J-O is the whole thing and it is the outside part. So I have J-O times J-O and set that equal to the whole thing over here, which is J-R times, once again, the outside part, J-D. All right, guys, this this theorem is the same thing. It's the, it's the whole thing times the outside part. The whole thing times the outside part. It just so happens that the outside part and the whole thing are the same here. By the way, algebra, all right? Anything times itself, I can rewrite as J-O squared. All right, so just keep that in mind. So we're on to, is this our last example? Yes, it is. All right. Once again, they intersect on the outside, all right, so I know I'm going to be using one of those theorems from above. The whole thing is 24, and the part is 24. Times those together, set them equal to the whole thing over here is 16 plus x. Multiply that by just the outside part, which is 16. All right, you guys got your calculator, do a little bit of math. Distribute that 16 in. All right, 24 times 24, 576 equals 16x plus 256. Subtract. Divide. done. All right, so three new theorems of the day. Um, make sure you got those down. And if you want to summarize them, put them in, you know, your box right here. Other than that, do your homework and have a great day.